Hello, we are running online exam project in this video. So basically here I am front end, I am using the JSP servlets and uh, integrated with the JPA layer. And the JPA properties I have defined, I am using the MySQL database, database name as online examination. And uh, I have mentioned, here I have mentioned the some predefined data that is the um, questions I have uh, defined and roles of the user and the uh, two user IDs I have defined here. We can also create the user in the, from the UI. Uh, one uh, constant user like admin I have, I have created in the by the query. And rest all the things like uh, required uh, questions based on the branch. Uh, we have the uh, of the questions also you can add the questions from the ui now let's check this logs server is started uh, now it is loading the jp queries in the if you observe in the persistence layer i had mentioned the ddl to hbms create so if any tables exist in the database first it will uh, drop the tables it will drop the tables then later it starts creating then it will load the our uh, questions and the users whatever we have given the input data now let's go to the browser we can check here the menus like home about us registration i will register one of the user here we can give the username, uh, email ID, password, and mobile number. After this, you will get a registered message. You can check in a database. So this is the last user is currently registered one. I will log in as admin to check this user details and the questions. Here are the admin. Uh, this is the admin page. We can see the number of students got registered. And if you want to add the questions based on the branches, you can add the questions. Admin will add the questions. The added questions will uh, appear here. What are the questions that have been added? Only admin can view this. And student results if any have taken let me log in one student and uh, take an exam if user want to change the password he can change the password let's take the exam he have the options like taking the exam different uh, subject wise let me take one exam here, Java based. You can give the all the answers. By default, I have given the 10 minutes time duration and the 10 questions. So I will just click uh, one by one. All the 10 questions I have to answer in a 10 minutes. Okay, uh, sometimes we can also give the some programmatical uh, queries. It depends on what kind of uh, how much difficulty questions you are going to frame for the particular subject so as soon you create uh, uh, give all the answers you can uh, uh, submit uh, your uh, results as soon you submit submit you will get a result here if you want you can save the result or else you can go for another uh, iteration results are successfully saved then user can view the results this one need to modify When you log into the admin, now admin can see the
we already shown the students questions and the view result admin can see the result and the contact any messages if admin want to add the some notice you can add the notice I will give the notice for exams some notice data so you can view and edit the notice or delete the notice is possible so when you go here in the notice window you can see the notice in the contactors any users want to contact they can contact from here So in the view context, you can see the you so admin can send a mail by seeing this whatever the queries or what type of contact they wanted to make. We have the contact number and the email ID. We can respond by these things. So this is how the online examination will work, and you can take the results and the you can generate the report from here. So this is what the demo for uh, uh, the online examination project. If you have not yet subscribed to the our channel, please subscribe. Uh, we are going to upload the few more students related projects and the concepts related to the uh, project development so that it will help for the viva or the interviews. Thank you all.